dear friends welcome back into my another video hope you are all doing well so i will discuss here uh, the important numerical as far as applied physics is concerned for the mechanical stream okay as uh, already i have included uh, this uh, crystal size determination in your passing package okay if you have watched that video so you have already gone through the determination of crystal size so on that particular basis we have a numerical which is a very simpler one these six marks are just in your pocket or sometimes five marks so determine the crystal uh, crystalline size uh, give, uh, given the wave length uh, wavelength of x rays 10 nanometer and the peak width is equal to 0 0.5 degree and the peak position is equal to 25 degree for a cubic crystal given k is equal to 0 0.94 okay so this k is called the cheerers constant so here we have given that is wavelength it is 10 in uh, 10 nanometer so we denote wavelength by lambda you already know it is 10 nanometer but we have to take it in terms of meters so while taking in terms of meters you already know one nanometer is equal to 10 raised power minus 9 meter okay so i can write down simply 10 into 10 raised power minus 9 meter this is in terms of meters right now okay lambda is equal to this much now what is given another peak width is equal to 0 0.5 degree so peak width is denoted by beta so beta is equal to 0 0.5 degree but you should kept one thing in mind uh, you have to take this beta that is peak width in terms of radians while taking in terms of radians what we have to do we can simply write beta is equal to 0 0.5 into pi upon 180 this is changing of a degree into radian if you have to change radian into degree then 180 upon pi so here we have to uh, multiply pi upon 180 okay when you just multiply it you will get the value accordingly so this is 0 0.5 multiplied by shift pi upon 180 which is equal to 8.72 into 10 power minus 3 so 8.72 multiplied by 10 power minus 3 this is radians now okay so this much is beta and another thing is peak position is given that is 25 degree it is denoted by 2 theta you have to remember these terminologies okay determinations 2 theta is equal to 25 degree means theta is equal to if you just divide 25 by 2 you will get 12.5 okay this is your theta in terms of degrees right now for a cubic crystal given cheerer constant is equal to 9, uh, 0 0.94 so k is equal to 0 0.94 this is given all all about okay now what is the formula you already know for the crystal uh, size determination we have the formula d is equal to k times lambda upon beta cos of theta okay so d is equal to k what is the k value 0 0.94 okay multiplied by lambda lambda is how much 10 into 10 raised power minus 9 meter right then divided by beta beta is how much 8.72 multiplied by 10 raised power minus 3 okay multiplied by cos of theta cos of theta means 12.5 uh, degree we have here that is 12.5 right d is equal to now if i calculate this much i will get the value 0.94 multiplied by 10 multiplied by 10 raised power minus 9 okay divided by 8.72 multiplied by 10 raised to the power minus 3 multiplied by cos of theta means 12.5 right okay so which is equal to 1.10 1.104 multiplied by 10 raised to the power minus 6 meters this is your crystal size okay what we have to determine in this particular question determine the crystalline size given uh, the wavelength of x rays okay so this much is your crystal size we are, we are getting here that is d is equal to 1.104 into 10 raised power minus 6 meter so this much carries 6 or 5 marks very simpler one this uh, you should not lose these 5 to 6 marks okay so you should practice uh, varieties of problems so i wish you all the best for your examinations thank you